The life and times of Keith Whitley returns in a moment. Cook, and it's called New Kid in Town. We're looking for the king. When he first came to Nashville, Keith soon found he was not the overnight sensation he'd hoped to be. His traditional roots didn't blend with the new wave of modern country, but vocally, there was no doubting his natural gift. Incredible range. He could go down, hit a bass note, and then turn right around, hit a, an almost falsetto note, and not miss a lick. I mean, he was incredible. He was absolutely amazing. There was times on stage when I would absolutely lose my train of thought as far as a player um, and get involved in what he was singing and his emotions and totally lose where I was at. Forget what song I was playing. It was only a matter of time before Keith landed a recording contract. He signed with RCA, the label of one of his heroes, Elvis Presley. When Keith signed, I'll never forget, I gave him the contract, um, and he wanted to sign it there on the spot. And uh, I said to him, you can't do that. He said, well, no, I mean, you know, if you're giving me this, this must be fine, blah, 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 and all that stuff. I said to him, Keith, you really need to get a lawyer. He was just so excited about being signed to RCA that it, it didn't make a difference. But Keith's excitement dimmed a little after he cut his first record for RCA. The radio station said it was too country. It didn't work. I mean, it was just embarrassing what happened. I mean, nothing. But it was that time in the format where we were just coming through the Millsaps and the Dollies and the Crystal Gales and the Kennys, and we were, we were moving more towards a mainstream sound. And even though Keith... Uh, was a great singer, he was still very traditional as an approach. Keith began to select more modern material to sing and had a few minor hits. It was around this time, in 1985, that Keith first met Nashville singer Lori Morgan, daughter of Grand Ole Opry star George Morgan. <laughs> 